What's going on guys? Steve Mansker with Total Access Reviews here. Today we've got the Infant Optics DXR8 Baby Monitor. This unit comes with a number of nice features, so we're going to go ahead and unbox it, take a look at it, and put it to the test and see exactly what it can do. Okay, so this is everything that the unit comes with right out of the box. We've got our camera here. It's got pan, tilt, and zoom. It's got interchangeable lenses right here. And in addition, it's got two-way talk built right into it. We've got our monitor here. And it also includes a retractable antenna on the back side. We've got our rechargeable power pack that goes into the monitor. We've got a power cord for our camera. We've got a couple of screws and anchors in case you want to mount that camera on the wall. We've got a zoom lens. We've got a three foot and 10 foot cord and we've got a power brick. So we're gonna go ahead and get this powered on and see exactly what it can do. Okay, so the first step for the setup, we're gonna go ahead and take our camera. It comes with a nice long power cord here. We're gonna go ahead and plug that into the back of the camera. We're gonna be placing on top of the bookshelf and it'll be directly over the crib. And then we're gonna take the end of it and plug it into a power outlet. So that's good to go. We're gonna make sure that that's positioned nicely over the crib. And we're gonna go ahead and grab our monitor and uh, plug the battery in and get that ready. So installing the battery into the monitor is going to be pretty simple and straightforward. We'll go ahead and flip our monitor over here and slip this cover off in the back. You'll notice there's a black, yellow, and red cable coming out of the uh, rechargeable battery. We we'll wanna make sure that those are in the correct order. And the black cable will be on the left side when you go to plug this in here. And simply plug it right into the connector and push that in and we are good to go. You'll put the battery in here and the cover will sit right on top. And we'll go ahead and hold the power button down to turn this on. Okay, so setup was pretty easy. It took less than five minutes to get everything set up and ready to go. I wanted to show you a couple of nice features on the monitor. On the back side, you'll notice it's got a nice little stand here that pops up. And in addition, it's also got an antenna here for extended range. We've got that as well. On the front, we've got a uh, power button here in the top. Simply press it one time to turn it off, one time to turn it back on. Now you've got your tilt and pan feature. Uh, this can pan up to 270 degrees. And it can tilt up to 120 degrees. And it's also got a zoom feature in here as well under the menu. You can control your volume and the brightness and several other features under the menu option. You've got a select or OK button here on the right. You've got a shortcuts button. And in addition, you've also got the two-way talk button here on the front as well. Another nice feature on this is it tells you the temperature where the camera is located. So it's currently 70 degrees in our nursery. And in addition, it's also got a infrared night vision. So we're gonna go ahead and turn the lights off in that room and I'll show you what that looks like. So with the lights off, uh, this is exactly what you can see. Um, there is currently a stuffed animal in the crib and you can clearly tell exactly what's going on there. The screen size in this unit comes in right at three and a half inches, which is a very nice size. Um, again, you can clearly tell exactly what's going on in the picture. And another nice thing this unit has, it's rechargeable, it does not run off of batteries. It's got the rechargeable battery pack in it and you'll just stick that into the side here and you'll plug that in, you're good to go. 